Hey kids, today we're making this awesome safari animal park. Okay, we've got a fence at the back to keep the animals in and a nice sandy bank for the animals. Okay, let's add some fences and another fence over here and some trees for some shade. <gasps> the car's here. Who's that in the back? It's a zebra! Did you know that baby zebras can stand up on their own after six minutes? Wow! All the cows here, who's this in the back? It's an elephant! Elephants live in Africa and Asia. Oh, it's a bit thirsty. Elephants use their trunk to drink water and eat food. Don't forget to close the gate. All the cars here. Oh, there's some water in the back. It's a fish. It's a clownfish. Clownfish are found in the tropical waters of the ocean. All the cars here. Who's that in the back? Whoops. It's a giraffe. Giraffe have this pattern on their body to help camouflage them in the wild. The car's here. Who's that in the back? It's a wombat. Did you know that wombats are nocturnal animals? This means that they are awake at night and asleep during the day. Don't forget to close the gate. Who's this riding on top? It's a tiger and it's bitten the back of the car. Nice one. Okay, let's pop the tiger up the back here next to the zebra. All oh, the cars here. Who's that in the back? It's an orcuppy. Orcuppies are found in the Democratic Republic of the Congo in Africa. Let's pop them in here next to the elephant. Don't forget to close the gate. The car's here. Who's that? Oh, it's a shark. It's a nurse shark. Nurse sharks are found in the ocean and are very active at night. They are usually found in groups. The car's here. Who's that in the back? It's an ostrich. Ostriches live in Africa and they can run up to 70 kilometers per hour. <gasps> Who's that in the back? It's a cheetah. Did you know that cheetahs are also nocturnal animals? That means that they are awake at night and asleep during the day. Don't forget to close the gate. Oh, who's this in the back of the car? It's a lion. Did you know that lions usually live in groups of 10 or 15 lions? And those groups are called prides. The car's here. Who's in the back? It's a panda. Pandas live on high mountains filled with bamboo forests in China. Don't forget to close the gate. Oh, who's this flying in? It's a toucan. Toucans live in Central and South America. The car's here. Who's this in the back? It's a crab. Did you know that crabs can walk sideways? Crabs live in the ocean and on the sand. The car's here. Who's in the back? It's a bandicoot. Bandicoots are omnivores, which means they eat plants and meat, such as bugs, earthworms and spiders. The car's here. Who's in the back? It's a chameleon. Did you know a chameleon can change its colour to camouflage itself? Wow! All oh, the cars here. Who's in the back? It's a penguin. Penguins are found in Antarctica, Africa, New Zealand, Australia, 
and South America. Oh, who's this flying in? It's a bat. A bat is another nocturnal animal. So let's pop them over here with the other nocturnal animals. <gasps> the car's here. Who's that in the bag? It's a seal. Seals like to live in cold waters and eat fish, birds and shellfish. Oh, the car's here. Who's that in the back? It's a koala. Koalas love to eat eucalyptus leaves from the eucalyptus tree. Wow! The car's here. Who have we got in the bag? It's a raccoon. Raccoons are also nocturnal animals, so let's pop them in here with the other animals. Don't forget to close the gate. <gasps> the car's here. Who's in the back? It's an otter. Otters are amphibious, which means that they can live on land and in the water. They like to spend most of their time in the water, especially sea otters. Who's in the back? Oh, it's an alligator. Alligators are considered reptiles. American alligators can be found in Florida and Louisiana. Oh, the car's here. Who's that in the back? It's a ring-tailed lemur. Ring-tailed lemur's tails are as long or longer than their bodies. Wow. <gasps> Who's that flying in? What a beautiful bird. It's a lorikeet. Nice landing. <gasps> the car's here. Oh, I can't see anyone. Oh, there they are. It's a quoll. Quolls are native to Australia and New Guinea. They are also primarily nocturnal, sleeping in hollowed out logs. Don't forget to close the gate. Oh, who's this coming in? It's a snake. Most snakes live on the ground, but others live in the trees. Hey kids, today we're making an animal zoo. Let's add some fences and trees for the animals to play in and some grass for the animals to feed on. Let's add some rocks. Okay. Who have we got? It's a lion. Okay, let's open up the gate at the back and put them in there. Raw! Nice one, buddy. Don't forget to close the gate. Ah, who's coming next? It's a giraffe. Giraffes love eating leaves of tall trees. So let's pop them at the back where the trees are. I think they like the trees. Don't forget to close the gate. Who have we got coming? I wonder who it is. It's a baby hippopotamus. Hippopotamuses love water, so let's pop them in there. Oh, we've got another animal in the back. It's a ring-tailed lemur. Okay, let's pop them near the zoo entrance on the grass. Oh, who's riding in the back? It's a leopard. Leopards love having fun in the water. Splash! So let's pop them in there. Someone's riding on top of the car. It's a tiger. Oh, and it looks like it's nudging the car. Okay, let's pop them in there. Did you know baby tigers are called cubs? Don't forget to close the gate. Who's in the back? It's an oryx. Okay, let's pop the oryx next to the ring-tailed lemur. Okay, we've got a truck bringing in some sand. Let's pop it here. 
let's make a habitat for animals that like living in sand. Oh, I wonder what animal this is. It's a camel. Camels can be found in deserts across the world. Who's in the back? It looks like an elephant. Okay, elephants love playing in water, so let's pop them next to the lake. Oh, I think they need a drink. Who's in the back of the car? It's a beaver. Did you know beavers can hold their breath underwater for 15 minutes? Wow! Who's this? It's a salamander. Oh, someone's riding on the front of the car. It's a meerkat. Meerkats also like living in sandy habitats. Let's build some more fences for the animals who are coming next. Who's in the back? It's an adult zebra and a baby zebra. Okay, let's pop them in the back here next to the tiger and the lion. Don't forget to close the gate. Who's coming in? It's a white duck. Oh, we've got something in the back of the car. It's a fennec fox. Fennec foxes like to live in the desert. Who's in the back of the car? It's a platypus. Platypuses love living in water, so let's pop them in the lake. Oh, we've got some more stuff in the back of the truck. It looks like a new habitat. Okay, let's pop it up the back and make a burrow for the next animal. Here's the animal. It's a wombat. Wombats love making burrows, so let's pop them in the burrow at the back. Wombats are nocturnal and like sleeping during the day. Who is that? It's a gorilla. All right, let's pop the gorilla up the back next to the trees. Oh, we've got another animal. It's a baby giraffe. I bet they're looking for their mum. Okay, let's pop them with their mum at the back. Oh, it's a sloth. A sloth is the slowest moving animal in the world. Let's pop them here. It's a rabbit. Rabbits sometimes use the burrows that wombats use. It's an eagle. Nice landing. Who's in the back of the car? It's a porcupine. Porcupines love to climb trees using their front and back claws. Who's coming? It's a chimpanzee. Chimpanzees get along with gorillas, so let's pop them together. Hi, buddy. Oh, who's in the back? They're green colored. It's a chameleon. Chameleons can change the colour of their skin to camouflage themselves in their environment. Oh, who's riding on the front? It's a bandicoot. Did you know bandicoots can jump using their back legs? Wow! Okay, let's get some rocks out for the next animal. It's a brown bear. Who's this? It's an echidna. Echidnas also love living amongst rocks. Okay, let's get this pond out for the next animal. It's a frog and a flamingo. And I think they're thirsty. Last of all, we have an anaconda. 
for watching kids. Don't forget to subscribe and I'll see you next time. Bye!